Back the Cherry Blossom Festival, cooling things down today with some ice skating. That's right, down at Central City Park. I like it. And some Mick and Mayhem players joined in on the fun, giving some skating lessons a little earlier today. That's not easy to do, trust -uh. me. Uh-uh. <laughs> and if you're out there ice skating or even riding some rides, you might need, of course, a sweet treat. Well, one of the best deals in town is on 3rd Street Park. Suzanne Lawler introduces us to one jolly fellow who makes it his mission to put smiles on faces, one refreshing drink at a time. You can have a jam up time every weekday at lunch during the cherry blossom. Unwrap a free pink Krispy Kreme donut. And of course, opt for some free cherry ice cream. Is that strawberries? It's very good. But hey, you've got to wash it down with something. Well, look at there. It raised all by itself. <laughs> Usually I have to go out and give it a pull. Hello, young man. The Coke company comes out and stocks the truck. I never actually know what they're going to bring each day. Glenn Held is an Air Force veteran. And then after I retired, I became Santa Claus and had a lot of free time during the rest of the year. And I joined the Riverside Optimus Club uh, 17 years ago. And one of their main focuses is volunteering with the Cherry Blossom Hello, Festival. My so the guy who does resemble jolly old Saint Nick made his new mission the pinkest party on earth, and he stuck with it for 17 years. When Glenn started off with the Cherry Blossom Festival, he started here at Central City Park, out there on the concrete, parking cars in the parking lot. But he said he didn't like it. He didn't like taking people's money. No, he wanted to give them something. I like to make people happy every chance I get. And at this time of the year with the food flowing and the blossoms blowing in the wind, well, there is a little magic in the air. Every day, people do kind things for me. It's just amazing. So I choose to be kind to everyone else. Isn't that wonderful? Yes, it is. Suzanne Lawler, 13 WMAZ News. And you can see Glenn tomorrow and Friday down at 3rd Street Park from 1130 until 130.